New overnight, a plan to increase the sales tax in Mecklenburg County is moving forward this morning. Mecklenburg County leaders approved the one cent increase to help fund the future red line commuter rail. WCNC Charlotte's Richard Devane joins us live now to break down what's next. Richard. Hey, good morning. Good Wednesday morning, everyone. If and I do mean if the sales tax is approved by voters, possibly next year, then that could mean the place I'm standing on could be part of the gateway. It would become the gateway uh, transit center, which is all part of the city's efforts to increase mobility in the area. The biggest part, of course, and the, the most important part is getting voters to approve that sales tax increase. Now, as we look at video, here's what's happening. Mecklenburg County leaders voted six to three to move forward with the proposed once in sales tax referendum to support future transit plans, including, as we mentioned, that red line system. Charlotte City Council also voted to support sending the sales tax proposal to state lawmakers who must sign off on the plan before allowing Mecklenburg County voters the chance to say yes or no to the tax increase. Now the one six sales, sales tax increase could generate as much as $345 million and which could also help that's in, in one year which could help get the red line project as well as the Charlotte Gateway Center built. Now we spoke to one former city leader about the plan Braxton Winston who's currently running as the Democratic candidate for North Carolina Commissioner of Labor. He says he does have some concerns about this current transit plan. Very concerned with the direction of the transit plan. The idea was that it's supposed to be uh, a, a kind of backbone to a, a larger regional network uh, that is needed to keep people moving um, in and through Mecklenburg County. Um, and I'm, I'm, I'm highly, highly, highly concerned uh, that the plan that's going forward will not be that, and that we will um, are considering investing in two different Charlottes. I thought that was something that we were supposed to be getting away from. And it's important to note that, that if legislators sign off on this referendum, voters would have the final say on whether there will be a one cent sales tax increase, possibly as early as next November. We're right here in Uptown. This is Richard Devane, Cinemac to you.